what's up everybody it's your boy tiger i'm out here at the same course that i played in the very first video i'm going to be trying to beat my score of the last time of two over nine holes it's a little windy overcast conditions may start raining just a little but hey all shots good and bad let me show y'all how we work clean work all right hole number one 540 yard par five Let's start off with a red number. Let's go. All right, so this is where my ball landed. I have 192 yards into the green. Time to go for it. All right, so this is where my ball landed. I didn't go to a bad spot, but that was probably one of the worst miscues I've had in a while. So let's try to get this up and down for birdie. Ooh, that might be good. All right, so I'm looking about like 20, 25 feet left for birdie. That was pretty good, <laughs> pretty good shot from where I was at. So at least I got to come off this hole with a par. Okay, so we're even through one on the hole number two, 190 yard par three. Let's keep it going. All right, so this is where my ball landed. I did come up a little short, but I did thin that about a groove and a half, a low, maybe two. So got to get up and down for par. I'm not making it easy on myself right now. All right, so I'm one over through two on the hole number three, 340 yard par four. Good chance for a birdie right here on the short hole like this. All right, so here's my ball. Probably about, I'm gonna say 50 yards in. Come on, <laughs> I need this birdie. All right, so once again, it was right at it, but literally like 10, 15 yards short, like 10, 15 yards short of where I wanted to land it anyways. So I got my work cut out. I got to get this up and down for par because I cannot afford any more strokes giving up. All right, so I'm one over through three on the hole number four, 126 yard par three. Another good chance to maybe get a birdie right here. All right, so this is where my ball landed, pin high, just barely off the green. Got a nice little, small little chip to get up and down for par. Keep everything floating steady. Okay, so I'm still one over through four. I am on to hole number five, which is a 360 yard par four. This is a pretty straightforward hole. This should be a hole that I should score really well on. The only thing is I played this course uh, Tuesday and they have a temporary green down there to the left side of like the actual green itself, putting surface, 
trash Bubba Dub voice. Just like that. All right, so this is where my ball landed. Have a hundred yards in. The wind is blowing back in my face, probably uh, a good 15 miles an hour or so. But right here where we're at in these trees, is kind of contained. So I'm gonna try to keep it low because once it gets over the top of some trees, the wind's definitely gonna hit it. So let's try to see if I can't try to hit one in there nice and snug. All right, so this is where my ball landed. Normally right here, I would chip this because I do have really good like control with my short game. But with this being a temporary green and then not being <laughs> the best putting surface, I'm gonna go ahead and probably put this. Oh! <laughs> well, Man, I ain't got nothing to say. Man, we're even through a five. We're on the hole number six, a 550-yard par five. Let's keep this thing rolling, man. All right, so there's where my ball landed. I have this little bitty window to try to get it out. I'm gonna try to hit it um, basically to the left of those two pine trees together, right in that little small gap and then just try to have a nice shot in to try to keep, have a good shot at birdie. Let's see what we can do. This is gonna be a heck of a recovery shot right here. Okay, I'm not messed up about that. All right, so here's my ball. It's back out in the middle. The flag is just right over the top of this little hill, right? I mean, right dead in the center of that uh, middle state that you see up there. I have 134 yards into the pin. The flag is a blind shot, so this is gonna have to be about feel and luck. All right, so here's where my ball landed and the nasty stuff. Dude, I hit a 110 yard club right there at 130 yards out and I uh, still flew the green. <laughs> so terrible flyer right here. So it's gonna be all on my short game now. Okay, we are even through six on the hold number seven, 290 yard par four. Definitely going for the green. This is one that I can definitely score birdie on. Let's go. That's gonna be really good. 290 yards, pin high. <laughs> Got a chance at an eagle. All right, you guys, I want to talk for just one second. Um, I'm one under with two holes left. And I'm approaching this hole where normally I hit an iron out into the fairway, play it, try to get off this hole with a par, because it can be tricky, because you can play it two ways. You can go for the green over the creek, or you can lay up before it. Right now, I'm hitting my driver really, really good. I am a momentum player. If I'm hitting my driver good, why would I not hit it again? Keep the confidence. Some people, they like to swap up. I'm a conservative player. But at the same time, you also have to know when you are when you need to ride the wave and when you need to get off. So right here, I'm definitely riding the wave. Come on, y'all. <laughs> One under. Let's go. Okay, 
So I forgot to also give an introduction to this hole. This is hole number eight, 288 yard par four. Um, as you can see, I pretty much drove the green again. Uh, but like I was saying, this is why you hit your driver instead of swapping something up and playing an iron right there. Uh, I got to hit this one in there close and hopefully I can keep in the red numbers. Let's go. All right, I am one under through eight. Last hole. Let's finish this thing with a bang. Let's go. Let's go, birdie right here. A hundred and fifty-four yard par three. All right, this is where my ball landed. I had a helping breeze, and I thought it was gonna help, so I took. I went down actually two clubs and. That was not the right choice, so I got to get up and down right here for a par. Par. All right, you guys, I finished the round. Well, finished nine holes, one under. I hope everybody enjoyed that round just as much as I did. That was a, a fun round. I had a little small goof ups here and there, but other than that, a very complete round. Short game was good. Hit a lot of fairways. If I wasn't on the green, I was pretty close to the green where I could get up and down to make some manageable shots. That's how you want to play around. Until next time, hey, your boy Tiger's out. Please like this video, subscribe to my channel, share it to your homeboys, your uncles, your grannies, your baby mamas, everybody share it. Go ahead and do that. Other than that, your boy out. Tiger.